All right. What is going on, everybody? It is Trib from Trib Talks here. And we're rooting to be the students mixed feelings about this signing. And I'm, I'm kind of the same way. You know, his offenses that he did run in the NFL averaged out to about 18th in the league. So, I mean, that's average, but it's definitely been better than most in, most of the offensive coordinators that the Jaguars have had in the past. And I would also say that it's something to get it's something to make you excited. You know, like Jay Gruden's a notable coach. He's somebody that you look at and you say, Oh, I know who Jay Gruden is. And the Jags usually like to give some to be uh, the new the newest offensive coordinator for the Jacksonville Jaguars, but I can't say I'm upset. Cam, what do you gotta say about the Jay Gruden signing, buddy? Decent. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying it's decent. I'm saying there's definitely, there was definitely, he's definitely the best option out of everybody that was available at the time, but it definitely wasn't the best option. You know, I kind of would have let wanted them to wait a little bit. Hey, shout out, hey, shout out to my dog Chris donating five dollars. I appreciate that. Um, but he was definitely the best coach available at the time that we did make the signing. So I can't say that it's terrible. But uh, expect some content on Jaguar Report that changed it from Jaguar Maven to Jaguar Report. Expect some reaction pieces from me telling you, giving you the full breakdown on this Jake Gruden signing. Uh, just had to do this live report for you guys. Again, Chris, thanks for the $5 donation. I saw Jay Dang in the chat. Some of my OG2 boys are in the chat. So I'm about to down some steak and mashed potatoes. And hopefully this Jake Gruden signing turns out to be a good one. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.